De Niro and Travolta together at last, and they hate each other this week at the movies. What the hell was that? Two of the screen's biggest stars just don't play nice in the new action flick, The Killing Season, now in theaters and on video on demand. You want a war? Come and get it. Robert De Niro and John Travolta play two veterans of the Bosnian War. De Niro's American and Travolta is Serbian, and they end up locked in a bloody battle of wits in the Great Smoky Mountains. I remember when I was in a battle of wits with the De Niro. It was at the Movies for Grown Ups Awards Gala in Beverly Hills a few years back. Are you looking at me? Here's a question for you. What was Robert De Niro's first acting role? I'll tell you at the end of the show. And if you haven't subscribed to Movies for Grown Ups yet, click right here. Everybody's doing it. You should too. Remember we used to come here after we got wasted. <laughs> What's wasted? Now the main reason I'm bringing up Adam Sandler's new movie, Grown Ups 2, is because it's got grown ups in the title. Riding your bike to school in the morning, you couldn't do that in LA. Yeah, thank God there's no crazy people out here. But Sandler and his pals play middle-aged guys who move back to their old hometown, so maybe there's a thoughtful, introspective quality to it. <laughs> or maybe not. Okay, all you fans of obscure Japanese cinema, here's one just for you. Seriously, I bet you've never seen the 1952 classic Life of Oharu by director Kenji Mizuguchi. And if you haven't, you're actually lucky. That's because there have been no good copies around of this amazing film until now, with a great new version from the Criterion Collection. So get a hold of it, it's a story of a woman who once had the world at her feet, thanks to her youth and her beauty, but now she's old and forgotten and utterly without a future. It's being remade as the Bill Newcott story. Don't forget, all good movie lovers, subscribe, like, and share this show. And leave a comment down below. I love reading what you think about the current crop of movies for grown-ups. Well, that's it for now. Oh, and De Niro's first role? At age 10, he played the Cowardly Lion when he was in a production of The Wizard of Oz. Ugh. Ugh. Courage. Hey, the show never ends on the Movies for Grown Ups channel. Add your review in the comments section below. Then subscribe, like, and check back next week for more Movies for Grown Ups.